eventually I will actually finish up this uh, Ben's haul. I got this giant mug. Be happy, be peaceful, be whole. It is a 10 strawberry street, but it is enormous, which is the only size to drink coffee. And then this one, uh, cactus coatings. Sorry, you are such a sore loser. And I love it because even though it is not giant, that's funny. If you would let me pause your show, we could talk about it. Got to check. And this is okay, great. Some weird cut pieces. I don't want it on the floor though. What I want it is in my lap so I can hold on to it. Okay. So we got all these different fabrics. And I'm trying to see what I got. Yeah. I can use this when I make my 4th of July thing. Yeah. Oh, that's cute. You like that one? I like it. Yeah? Okay. Check it out. You check it out? Okay. You check it out? Okay. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Baby, hold on. Please don't do that. Please don't do that. You got it? Is it like a quilt? Yeah, somebody was already making a quilt. That's so cool. Let me see what you got. Can I see what you got? Look, it's just lots of strips. Those are super cute. Oh, wow. Look at all those little pieces. Look at it. I'm going to have so much fun cleaning oh, that up. Boy, Look how these are all just pieced together and some oh. are cut. Yeah. All right. We got lots of starts to quilts there. Yeah. 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 We're going to have to figure something out with that. Yeah. Yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah. Oh my goodness. Look how pretty this one is. What? 
so pretty. We got some butterflies. Look, butterflies. Yeah, I got strips. Yeah. Black and white. All kinds of different scrappies. Yeah, just toss those at my feet. Oh my goodness, look how cute this one is. It's got lots of little penis on it. Is that cute? Yeah. Yeah, just all kinds of fabrics, huh? Man. This is just a whole treasure of fabric. Yes. Yeah. Hold on. Hey, hold on. Goodness gracious. Hold on. Look, that one's got purple. Yeah. Oh, I love this one. So cute. <laughs> what are we going to make with all this? Are we going to make a quilt? Yeah. yeah. Yeah, I think we will. Oh, this one's got hummingbirds. Okay. This one's got some kind of a little scene. What do we got? Oh, it's. I think it's Thomas. That's super cute. Yeah. Wow, look. Look, this matches your purple. See, it matches. It goes with your purple. Yeah. Gritty together. It got all kinds of stuff, huh? Yeah. I think the only way I'm going to actually be able to do my haul video is if I do it while I'm in the backyard with my granddaughter. So we're going to try to do that right now. Now, I've got this super cute Zara top. It's got this lace overlay with this like striped shirting. It's super cute. What was that? This size extra small. Baby, don't climb in that. These are just some old navy active pants. I think they'll fit me. If not, somebody might want them. Spiritual gangsta. One size. The little kimono type Okay. I got these Lee straight leg. See, told you not to get up there. They are size twos. You're okay, Booba? Okay, Booba. You, Booba's okay? okay. All right, cool. They are size twos, which is what my daughter is wearing right now. So I thought maybe she would like them. Got these Zara pants. They are smalls. Little palms tooth. Kind of a pencil leg. Got this elastic on the back. And this is Tibby New York, size small. It's like a vest this little cheer overlay. Oh look, it's my son coming out because of course everybody knows I'm doing something. I've got linen and then 100% silk for the trying to. And this counterpart size 10, this little jacket. 
got a little elasticy waist, cute purple floral. This thing, camel hair, sports jacket. It is, uh, I think it's just Charter Club, or Club Room by Charter Club. It's such a nice sports coat that I had to get it. This needs a good shaving. Allen Flusser XL Cashmere little sweater. And just some Levi's 550s. Might try to uh, play with those. A little upcycling. This. Haptics by Holly Harper. Just cute little pullover. Or not pullover, but tunic top. Got these Old Navy XXL. They look linen. I don't think they actually are linen. Let's see, we got. Well, they're 55% linen, 45% rayon. And the last one in this bag is this Lauren, Ralph Lauren, size 16, tweed jacket. And that's that bag. Alright, this bag has some linens and some clothing. And I've got this still in the package, Christmas tablecloth and then there's one that's out of the package. It's got some stains I need to try to get out. It was just a Walmart one but it was super cute. Uh, a Braves hat and this one is apparently the Atlantic Fishing, I don't know, something. American Fishing Tackle Company. It needs to be cleaned up. And this Tablecloth, which quite honestly, there's no tag in it, but it feels really nice. I don't know what it is. Don't want to hammer. Alright. These definitely <laughs> a vintage look to it with the lace. It is a Water, water, W A T T E R, cotton and acetate, whatever, size 20, I think it says. I thought I couldn't leave it. Yep, hold on. This is turned inside out now. Mikey! Alright, shirt's all wet now because grandbaby decided to run into the hammock and I had to go rescue her. Alright, we've got this. Looks like a 80s bridesmaid dress. It says size 11 on the inside. There's no branding. It just says dry clean and size 11. I would doubt it's an actual size low. There's the tie for it. And this is intro large. Just a tunic. A little sheer top on it. And this this is amazing. I, I, it's another one of those I just couldn't leave it because what if I didn't get it and nobody got it and then it's just thrown away beautiful 
him on it. Uh, and then the interior skirt. This lace. And another layer underneath that. That's an extra large. Possibly fit me. I'm sure there was supposed to be a top that went with it, but I did not see it. And this bag is just randomness. If you saw my shop with me video, then you saw the Kool-Aid jug, and I've got two, two cups. Billy Carter beer mug. I drank a beer with Billy. I have no idea. It was cute. It obviously is vintage. Got these little shoes, yellow box. They are in really good condition. They are a size uh, seven and a half. What the bear? Baby. That's, that's, that goes to the Legos. There's a book? Yes, there's a book. Okay. You look at the book. Okay. They had a bin with lots of Legos. I have no idea what pieces I got that are actually supposed to go with this set. But they had all kinds of little people and well, there's Steve, but uh, I don't know anything else. There's I got a whole bunch of little, uh, I forget what these are called. We have zombies, we have little robot -y things. Like, and then. of it says Studio Spiga made in Italy um, we have part of some legs in there uh, obviously leather eight and a half super nice little heeled loafers they need to be cleaned up a bag of uh, just random Star Wars figures. Oh, you got it? And this bag has more of those little micro mini things. There are some little Star Wars things in here. I don't know. Lots of little toys. What's that? Okay, camera's on that side. Hey, hey, guys. What else you got? Is that a little horse? Yeah. That Lego horse? Yeah. Horse. Yeah. Oh. You got lots of stuff in there, huh? Yeah. Don't hurry me. Come my hurry. my dragon I got this mm -hmm. what else you got
Yeah. Oh wow, you got a whole big pile of them. You just poured them right on out. Hey ha. Hey ha. Oh, you want to see? You want to see what fits on that? Hold on, let me see if I've got one. This guy doesn't have an arm. Let's see if I can find Steve again. Steve will fit on that horse. Here. Nice. This. This fits on your horse. Or he should fit on your horse. Hold on, let me see if I can get his, his feet in there. His hands out. And his feet. And there he goes. Go here. I think that's an arm. This guy. He's got five. This guy got, is missing an arm. Yeah. There's, either, there's all kinds of stuff we don't need to pour out, baby. There's a lot of little pieces. Well, we gotta we gotta pour them out in something. We're not gonna lose them, okay? No, okay, okay. I'll put it on. Okay, hold on. Yet another bag. Got some more uh, Levi's super skinny 535s, 29s. Not sure what that equates to, but they looked like they were in really good shape. I do. I did get the bracers and the head thing to go with this, and my granddaughter keeps stealing it. Got this little uh, other costume. It's, I only have the top and the pants with the suspenders. Apparently, if you bought it new, it came with um, a ruffle collar and something else. A hat, maybe. This is a, I want to say it's Liz Claiborne. Where is the tag? Yes. Liz Claiborne, size 16. It's this black and gold lace. It's got this rhinestone detailing and this little keyhole in the back. Very simple. Oh, don't put that in the water. Why do you put it in the water? I don't want to dry it again. You've put it in the water before. This is uh, Max Studio Specialty Products. It's an extra small, just this little floral, lightweight dress. It's super cute. It'd be great for this spring and the summer. This is a intimately free people top. Extra small. It could be worn as a dress, a, a, a pullover for your swimsuit. You could sleep in it. And pull large. It's just this cute tunic. It's got this big zipper in the back. Super soft. These are just basic Kato size large linen pants, 53, 8% linen. Just the basic pants. I don't know, these don't have a brand. I don't know if it's 929 with the nurse's heart in it means anything to anyone. They are size medium. That's all I know about them. I feel like there's probably some branding somewhere, but I couldn't find it. Another nurse's thing. It's a scrub top, I think. Size medium, koi. If you want to have a little different scrub. Some Levi's shorts, size 28. These are bamboo brand, you know, engineered distress, skinny. Oop. Some styling co size 16 with the tag still. Boyfriend jean. This is. Maggie McNaughton, 22. It's a velvet. 
this little design with gold stitching. This is a robe and a nighty. Uh, Serenata size 2X. Nighty. I'm not going to pull it all out. I have it kind of together. So this little full on dress. Speed. Speed Control New York. Just a little pull up top. And this vintage ugly Christmas sweater. Got shoulder pads. Is it super wet now? Thank you. Oh, that's super helpful. <laughs> anyway, that's that bag. All right, we have our last bag. It actually wouldn't exist, except I went back inside to return my cart. And um, I saw a bracelet, which actually is in the car, because I handed it to Aurora to play with. And it's still in there. But I uh, ran through and got a few more things. It's just a little southern fried cotton. It's just, it's got a little hole here. It's just for me. I don't mind a hole. But I saw this laying there after I found the owl cuff bracelet. It's just a little uh, Oshkosh, but it's got little mushrooms on it. It's a 2T. She can still kind of wear 2Ts. I'll do that one last. Got this giant Land's End puffer jack, well, tote. I think it's supposed to have a hood, but it is also good without it. I assume this is a Land's End night shirt because nobody has buttons that big and it's got this uh, yoke stitched into it this has more problems than I thought it's got some uh, holes there it's just a little gauzy lace top and this is an easel tunicky top. It says it's a medium. It's very big, very blousy. And oh, two more little kids. Got this Hannah Anderson little dress and a Matilda Jane little top little dress it's a size 2 and as I was checking out a lady threw these up because she decided not to get them and uh, I grabbed them they are REI pants they look like they've never been worn. I did get one more thing. That's pretty amazing. So I saw the satin jacket laying there and so I was starting to look at it and it had this gold interior and I thought it was just black with gold. Oh no. It is a days of our lives. Satin jacket. Uh, apparently these were made for the crew and the, there's only one, another one. I only found one more online. And uh, it was on Etsy. And the lady was asking $799 for it. Which obviously, no. But uh, I thought it was pretty interesting. I grew up watching Days of Our Lives. And I thought somebody else might find it awesome. Like I do. Okay. So I had one more bag. I totally forgot about my bag with a lot of the hard good stuff in it. So I'm going to try to do that once again with the baby running around. Hold on. We got this little candle holder. We 
have this Scotland Loch Ness Monster pint glass and the, well you can't see it, Paul Bunyan and Babe the Blue Ox. There's this cut glass bowl. I love the like quilty design and then this is like peppermint candies. I don't know. I have jeans from the last trip that I went on in here. Alright, we've got this little mug. It's got ooh, ooh, ooh. please don't. It's an anthropology brand. Okay, hold on, sweetie. You got the little piggy? It was so cute. You wanna hold the piggy? Okay, you can hold the piggy. We got the Hawaii mug. Got this picture. It's marked Edward. See them? I got. I got to show the camera. Can I show them? Come here. You want to show them? Come here. Can you show them? Huh? You got? Yeah. We got a. a oh, here. Let's hold it where they can see. For your little. Your tea bag, and then we have these tall salt and pepper shakers. Okay. Yeah, those are nice. Thank you. This, the rinse quick automatic rinsing replacement spray nozzle could come in handy. Also, no, it doesn't open, sweetie. No, 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 no. We don't just bang them together. No, Thank you. Fine. No, it's not fine. This bowl with its flower petal design. Oh, and the Santa Claus. He needs a little scrubbing too, I think. But little nice guy is a resin, and uh, I think that's it. I think that is officially the end of the haul. Oh wait, the uh, owl cuff bracelet that I saw that drug me back in the second time. I think somebody plucked its eyes out because the ones I see online have like crystals in them but they're not like important crystals so I don't know why they plucked them out but anyway that's it that is officially it don't forget to like subscribe and share thank you for watching I would love to hear what your favorite find was